Hello guys, this is Miss Ana Luisa Bermea and we're in fifth grade. And today we will work on spelling on vowel consonant vowel patterns. And you have this lesson already in your notebook. Go and get it. Repeat after me. Human. Human. Exact. Exact. Award. Award. Behave. Behave. Credit. Credit. Basic. Basic. Vivid. Vivid. Evil. Evil. Modern. Modern. Nation. Nation. Robot. Robot. Panic. Panic. Select. Select. Cousin. Cousin. Item. Item. Police. Police. Prefer. Prefer. Menu. Menu. Novel. Novel. Deserve. Deserve. Autumn. Autumn. Nuisance. Nuisance. Logic. Logic. Column. Column. Lasser. Lasser. Now, we will work on page 136 on our practice. Write the basic word that best complete each analogy. Let's read number one. Fire department is to fire. As blank department is to crime. As police department is to crime. Let's go to number two. Job is to task as pride is to the word job and task are synonyms. So the, from the list, the synonym for price is award. Noise is to quiet. Noise is a synonym. Sorry, noise and quiet are antonyms. So we need an antonym for calm, panic. All is to young. These are antonyms. As ancient is to modern. Nile is to river, as United States is to nation. And you will complete from 7 to 12. Thick is to thin, as draft is to blank. Separate is to split, as shoes is to blank. These are synonyms. Program is to television, as food is to, this is from degree. Memo is to note. As object is to, and these are synonyms. Special is to ordinary, these are antonyms. As approximate is to blank. Oak is to tree, as blank is to family. Okay, I want you to complete the page. Now, on this page, you will need to have the words divided into syllables in your notebook. Now, I want you to pay attention to the patterns. Vowel consonant vowel. So that means that you will write a word where you have this pattern. Let's write the word human. And pay attention. Let's write human. And you will write hu, hu, period, man. And we will see the pattern. Hu, man. And I want you to write with red the period to separate the vowel consonant vowel pattern. Human, right there, between the U and the M. Uh -huh. Human, okay, very good, human. Now let's write the word exact. The word exact goes on the second box where it says vowel, consonant, vowel, okay? Let's write the word EX, and then we have the period or the, where we separate the syllables with the by at, X at. And I want you to do it the same as I did A C T S exact. Now I want you to pay attention to the patterns vowel, consonant. Vowel, consonant, vowel. And you have here and you have here the vowel, consonant, vowel pattern. And let's review the pattern from the words below. Vowel, consonant, vowel. So that means that you have the vowel and then the consonant with a vowel. So I want you to do it the same I did. Okay, let's go to page 138. Proofreading for spelling. Find the misspelled words and circle them 
write them correctly on the lines below. Thomas Penny wasn't happy in England, his homeland. He tried to behave in a way that would please his superiors, but he wasn't a robber. He had his own ideas, but they keep getting him in trouble. Then Payne met Ben Franklin, who told him to go to America. Franklin thought Payne would prefer the New World to England. Once in America, Payne discovered he could write well, not a novel, but vivid prose. He wrote a pamphlet called Common Sense to Encourage People to Raise Up Against Evil King George. To his credit, Payne felt he did not deserve an award for his work. He just wanted to live in a nation with a modern government that tries to meet the basic needs of all human beings. He wrote other pamphlets too, always encouraging people to be involved in government. He was glad he came to America. Okay, I want you to identify the 13 misspelled words and write it down. And remember, I love you every day, not just on Valentine's Day. Love you, kids. Goodbye. Take care.